In high performance data centers and supercomputers, the computation is done by rack mounted servers with processing and memory. The servers are connected to each other through a high bandwidth network. A direct electrical connection is usually made to a switch at the top of each rack, which is connected by fiber optic links to the rest of the network. Instead of a single big switch, the network is made of layers of rack mounted switches interconnected to each other by fiber optic links. A single data center can contain thousands of servers and as many as seven layers of optical interconnects between these switches. Data centers are already a large energy user, and recent estimates project that by 2025 they will consume as much as 4.5% of total global electricity production. The ARPA-E Enlightened program addresses this problem on two levels at the optical interconnect component level and for the overall compute system. Most of the energy is consumed by the servers themselves even when they're idle and waiting for data, which they often are due to the cost and bandwidth limitations in conventional networks. So one path to significant energy savings is to improve the network bandwidth. Enlighten's LEAD research project radically transformed the conventional network. It replaces most of the network with a single layer of transparent optical switches and a control plane based on pre-programmed connection maps. The rotor switch is a free space optical switch that images an entire array of input fibers onto a disk of diffraction gratings rotating at high speed. The gratings deflect the data transmissions into a series of pre-programmed network connections. This simple architecture allows a low loss and highly parallel switch. The overall network, called RotorNet, controls packet routing. The rotor network transmits continuously, knowing which connections are active at each moment, and using multiple hops when needed to expedite low latency traffic. The overall network bandwidth is significantly higher than for a conventional cost comparable network. Network level modeling conducted within the Enlighten program has shown that RotorNet can substantially improve the task completion time. These initial results show that making the same computation using RotorNet can consume less than half the energy as using existing cost comparable networks. This would achieve the primary goal of the Enlighten program. Enlighten's phase two will resolve any remaining fundamental barriers to practical optical cluster networks and also demonstrate a fully operational system. This will provide a clear path to full-scale commercialization of an important energy-saving technology.